Hi, in this video I'll show you how to set up new project calendar or modify an existing project calendar in MS Project 2016. If you look at the menu bar, you see different commands. One of these commands is project. If you just click the project command, you see different groups of commands appear here. One of these commands is change working time. Just click it. Our dialog box opens up here. Here you see, if you uh, click the drop down, you see we have three calendars already available in MS Project. One is standard, second one is uh, 24 hour calendar, third one is a night shift calendar. The first one, let's click first one. You see here, so on a given date, if that's a typical date. So day starts at 8 a.m. in the morning till 12 p.m. with a break of 1 hour at 12. Then it begins at 1 p.m. Then the day finishes at 5 p.m. If you collect the next one, that is 24 hours. So you see here, the day begins at 12 a.m. in the morning, at the midnight, sorry, and finishes at the midnight of the following day. And if you click a night shift, you see here, so the night shift begins at 12 a.m. midnight and continues till 8 a.m. in the morning. Right, so it's up to you which one of these three options you can choose. You can um, even modify existing one also. Alternatively, you can create your own new calendar. And if you click a new, a new dialog box opens up here. So here we have two options again. The first one option is create a new base calendar. So here we will have to put every detail on our own. Alternatively, we can make a copy of the three, one of the three calendars, 24 hours, night shift or standard one, and then modify it. It's quite up to you. Say for example, we are going to uh, adopt standard project calendar and uh, then modify it suppose on 25th december we have a non-working day but currently it's showing that is a working day if the working time begins at 8 a.m and finishes at 5 p.m let's make it a non-working day then how to do it just beneath this here we uh, write some notes here say for example happy christmas day so you will see the date will appear here, right? The moment we did it, you see here. So what has happened? So 25th December is now a non-working day. The moment we do it, you see a new gray line will appear here. So that would show that it's a non-working day. So it's uh, 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 25th December 2018. Let's go back to the same. Well, again, so we can even change the time also. And how to do it? Say, for example, uh, on 26th December, on the following day, uh, we want to make the changes. So, following 26th December, uh, half day, say. So you see 26 December will appear because it has we, we have already selected it. Now go to the details and in the details, so currently it's, no, uh, it's showing it's a non-working day, let's make it a working day. So let's remove it and make it from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. only and uh, just uh, click it. And uh, now you would see it will show 26th December. It will show as the working day, but you will see with only only half working day. Right. So we can adopt the same policy for all those days if they are on a recurring basis. From a given date to a certain date, we can do it. Now suppose we have created a new calendar and uh, we want to adopt it. How to do it? So just beneath the tab of the project, you see one option is project information, just click it. 
a new dialog box opens up here. So in this dialog box you see here, the so one option is a calendar. Just click it. If you have created a new project calendar, you can it will appear here. So then you can select it. Say for example, let me um, take an ex uh, give you an example. So change working times. So let me make a new calendar here. So adopt a make a copy of the calendar. So just do it and uh, then go to project information. So here you see so the copy of the calendar the standard calendar it's a peony cat let me select it and click it okay so now it this project now will adopt the new calendar which has been adjusted so this is how we can adopt a new calendar or adapt a new calendar or modify an existing calendar or create a new calendar so thanks for watching